<laughs> Next, weather meteorologist Casey Sherman. I certainly would say it's hot at this point, but we're looking at a cool down at some point later. Yeah, I mean, thunderstorms are almost a good thing when you've got the heat like this. We certainly saw that nice cool down yesterday after a round of excessive heat warnings yesterday for Broward, Miami Dade County. We don't have those in effect at least yet for today. We continue with our heat advisory though out across the metro area down to the Keys. Feels like temperature is still ranging from 108 to 111 degrees, so it is still going to be another very tough day of heat. But yes, we will have some thunderstorms eventually as we get into later on this afternoon. Temperatures out the doors. We start the Sunday morning, lower 80s, already feeling like we are in the 90s for some spots. Pembroke Pines being one of them close to that Miami and Fort Lauderdale, but we're going to be heating up quickly today. In fact, we're looking at what should be another round of near record highs. Yesterday we had a high of 93 degrees, just shy of a record of 94 yesterday. Today will get close to another record in Miami at least. The forecast high of 94 degrees and our old, old record standing at 95 degrees. Notice we do some showers and storms, but they've been offshore and they're moving away from the coast. The same kind of wind direction. These winds out of the west mean our storms today are going to be moving from west to east. So eventually we will have them wind up right here across our coast, the east coast and south Florida, but it won't be until after about 2 o'clock. So expect those afternoon thunderstorms 3 o'clock through 5 o'clock, likely featuring our highest chance for rain and storms today. Out across the tropics, we have tropical storm Gordon in the central Atlantic. We also continue to monitor an area just offshore of the southeast coast for development as we into the next few days.